All right, so let's start singing this song because it's gonna be October 9th. If you don't know these two songs, my generation I can't and I can't explain. These songs are actually from the British Invasion. And this song is actually from 1965 if I'm not mistaken. So let's just try and sing this one. First off, my generation. People try to put us down talking about my generation. Just because we get around talking about my generation, things do look awful cold. Talking about my generation, I hope I die before I get old. Talking about my generation, my generation. This is my generation, baby. Why don't you all fade away talking about my generation and don't try to dig what we all say talking about my generation not trying to cause a big sensation talking about my generation talking about my generation talking about my gen this is my generation this is my generation baby my my my, my da, 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 generation generation why don't you all fade away talking about my generation and don't try to think what we all just did talking about my generation i'm not trying to cause a big sensation talking about my generation i'm talking about my generation talking about my generation this is my generation this is my generation baby my 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 my, my. My generation, baby. My, 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 my generation, generation. People try to put us down talking about my generation. Just because we get around talking about my generation. They say do awful cold talking about my generation. Yeah, I hope I die before I get old. Talking about my gen, this is my generation. This is my generation, baby. My, 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 my generation, generation. This is my generation. This is my generation, baby. This is my generation. It's my generation. It's my generation. It's my generation, baby. It's my generation, baby. It's my generation. Okay, so if I'm not mistaken, when uh, this song was actually released, so basically the song was released in 1965 as the Who Sings My Generation, and then the album was actually a quick one, which was Happy Jack. So basically, I'll just say it's like, I don't know what to say. Okay, okay, let's just continue this song. Alright, I Can't Explain. So I Can't Explain was actually released on January 15th, 1965. Basically, the Who members were actually very young by then. They were around 18 to 20 years old, with Keith Moon being the youngest drummer at just 18 years old, you know? Okay, let's just get on with the chase and sing, all right? I've got a feeling inside, can't explain, it's a certain kind, can't explain, I feel on a cold. Can't explain the sound of my soul, yeah, can't explain. Hmm. I said, can't explain, I'm feeling good right now, yeah, can't explain. Dizzy in the head and I'm feeling blue. The things you said, well, maybe they're true. Again, funny dreams, again and again. I know what it means, but I can't explain. I think it's love God said to you When I feel blue, when I can't explain Can't explain, if you want to sing, girl Can't explain So basically there's actually like a pause in between So the chorus apparently goes right here And then we go on to verse 2 of the song Alright, let's start Dizzy in the head and I'm feeling bad the things you say got me real mad I'm getting funny dreams again and again I know what it means but I can't explain I think it's love God said to you When I feel good but 
can't explain, can't explain, but give me one more time, yeah, can't explain. So then we got the outro right here, it says like, the outro right here, it's actually like the end of the song right here. I said I can't explain, you give me out my mind, I can't explain, I'm worrying kind, I can't explain, yeah, I'm a worrying kind, and I said I can't explain. So basically that was actually for like the song which is actually featured in the Foo. So basically what I was gonna say is that uh, during that time, John and Whistle never never had like a uh, facial hair basically what i was gonna say is that they really didn't have it he didn't have facial hair during that time but in the 1970s it, he did well i'm not gonna really lie okay so why do you think it's like necessary to have like this kind of stuff well what i'll just say it's like it's not it's not really necessary there's no right or wrong for people wearing this kind of style but even though i don't like it i can just still respect it okay I basically do like the 60s to the mid 70s John and Twister where he didn't have like this kind of style, you know, like like that. This is what I apparently apparently like. But for the other style which is like 1970s, 1980s, 1990s, that one I like I seriously don't like that kind of style. Basically in my opinion because I do believe it's getting a bit too uncomfortable with it, okay? It's getting a bit too com uncomfortable. So basically I want to apologize and say I'm so sorry for my singing. If it's bad then you can just like uh correct um correct the lyric correct some grammar mistakes for me because you know how I really feel about it. Sometimes the song can like go like I can't explain, I think it's love, God said to you when I feel good. Yeah, that's the problem I have. And for my generation, I hope I adore before I get old. Talking about my generation, it's my generation. It's my generation, baby. This is the part I'm getting really bad off. You know, like, I'm just getting really bad up, but I'm still, like, warming up, you know? You know, like that. Now, this is actually the end of the video, and I just want to decide this to John and Tristle. Happy 78th birthday to the late basis of the Who, uh, John and Twisto. If he was still alive today, he would have turned 78. And eventually, I didn't know about the news until then. I wasn't even born in 2002 by then, you know, like, I wasn't even born on that day. You know, that I wasn't even born on the day John and Twisto died, you know. I was, like, actually not born yet, you know, like, I was actually not born yet. But if you're like seriously born in like the the, the thousands, you may know about what happened to John. But in this generation, we don't know. We don't exactly like know, you know, because I wasn't born in two thousand two. You know that. I think everyone should know that. All right, all right. So I think that's all for now, and this is me signing off.